Hello, I'm Dr. Julie Brown, and I have here the four brands of epinephrine auto-injector that are available in the United States. I have EpiPens, which actually come as both an, a brand EpiPen and a generic, both of which you see here actually, but these work identically, so we're going to treat those as if that's the same device. I have a Tiva generic, which is a generic for EpiPen. I have an AviQ, and I have a, an Amnial Lineage generic for Adrenoclick, although Adrenoclick is actually not available in the United States. So um, I've shown these, the EpiPen and its generic, and the Amnial um, both inside and outside of their case, so you get kind of the full um, sense of these devices. So I'm going to take these one at a time and I'm going to fire them into this block of ballistic gelatin so you can see what happens as each of these devices fire. So first we take the EpiPen out of its case. We remove the blue safety cap. Make sure you can see well where it's firing. Put a little bit of glare. One, two, three. We hold it for three seconds. And as it comes back, you can see that the needle cover comes down over that needle and there's no exposed needle. Next, this is the Tiva device. We twist off this yellow cap. We take off the blue cap starting from the short side and flip it forward. One, two, three. We also hold that one for three seconds. And again, the cover comes down over the needle as it's withdrawn. Next we have Kaleo's AviQ, and for purposes of demonstration I'm going to wait and let you hear the prompts, although you don't actually have to wait for the prompts in order to use this device. If having an allergic emergency, pull red safety guard down and off of AviQ. Place black end against outer thigh. Then push firmly until you hear a click and hiss sound and hold in place for two seconds. Place black end against outer thigh. Two, one. Injection complete. Seek emergency medical attention. And I think you can see with this device that the needle retracted as soon as the injection was complete. And um, is retracted right back up into the device. And finally we have the Amnial Lineage Generic and you can see this has two caps. You can remove these caps in any order. This device you hold for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 9, 10. And when you withdraw, you can see it has an exposed needle. So for safety, you're going to put that back in the case to prevent a needle stick injury. And that's it. Be safe. Be well. Thank you for watching.